Hey y'all. So um I'm gonna do a reading for Divine Feminine. Spirit, give me messages for Divine Feminine. Spirit, give me messages for my girl Divine Feminine. Seven of Pentacles. Mm, I feel like somebody. I just heard impatient. I feel like somebody's being impatient. Divine Feminine, this could be you or in regards to you. I feel that someone. This could have something to do with money. I feel like you have money but it's like you you thinking like what the fuck i need more money or i need to make more money or this could be in regards to you divine feminine yeah you popped up in your reading divine feminine bad bitch uh I just heard manifester. I feel like divine feminine, you could be like working on something or trying to manifest something. And I feel like you have been seeing some things you've been manifesting or if you've been writing down your goals, I feel like you've been accomplishing your goals. But I feel like it's not coming in as fast as you would like. Or you tired of waiting for something to grow? And I just feel like just exercise patience because you the, you the motherfucking empress. Um, you can demand and command anything and it's going to come to you effortlessly. Uh, Divine Feminine, I feel that you could be walking away from people, places, and things that no longer serve you. Or you don't have no problem cutting people off. Or this is someone in regards to you. Another message I'm getting. Somebody could be like cutting you off or walking away from you. Because they feel like you're too much. You too good for them. Or you so beautiful. It's something about you to where I heard tame. Somebody feel like they can't tame you or control you or something. I feel like somebody is disappointed that they can't be with a person like you. They can't be with a bad bitch. I just heard less than. So they going to get someone that's less than you, Divine Feminine? Ace of Wands. I feel like somebody is going to put in work into something. A project. Something. Somebody could be working on something. Divine Feminine, this could be you or someone in regards to you. And whatever they're working on, this is something that somebody is passionate about. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like somebody is working on something. They're going to get the drive to work on something that they're passionate about. Somebody could be an artist. Somebody could be very creative at something. Or Spirit, put one on the Seven of Pentacles. Knight of Wands. I feel that Divine Feminine. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Or an earth sign. Or. I feel like. This fire sign can like you. Or this. 
it could be a fire sign or a, a earth sign. I feel like somebody likes you. Or Divine Feminine, you could like somebody, but this person is very flighty. They in and out. You just never know with them. You could be disappointed in them or their behavior towards you. I just heard sex. Divine Feminine, this could be somebody you had sex with or had some type of relationship with. And I feel like they, this person could be full of shit. Like, they just got a lot going on in their life. Spread put one on this Empress card. I feel like somebody likes you, but, like, once you start talking to them or conversing with them or even date them, it's going to be a disappointment. I'm not going to take all these. Spirit, um, another message I got, y'all could have had some type of relations and this person, like, ghosted you. Y'all could have, like, had sex or something. Or if y'all didn't hook up, you know, y'all could have been talking here and there, conversing a little bit, and this person ghosted you. This person disappeared and you kind of upset about it like what the fuck spirit put one on this empress card but let me tell y'all it's nothing personal i feel like this person just this person this i feel like this person could have like a lot of hoes or you know they have a lot of women they fuck with or this person just always on the go. They never... You just never know with this person, okay? Temperance. Divine Feminine. It's time for you to, you know, have balance. And have some type of self-control. I feel like Divine Feminine... Like I said, if this is not you, this is in regards to you. Um, the first, well, not the first story, but the story about if somebody, if you messed around with somebody and they ghosted you and you feel some type of way, spirit wants me to tell you, like, don't even sweat that shit because at the end of the day, you a bad bitch. And I feel like this person is even lucky to even be with you or to sleep with you. So, don't even, like, trip about that shit. And you need to get back grounded. You need to get back peaceful. Peace, love, and harmony. Get back to what you represent. You're not a sad bitch at all. So, Spirit wants you to get out of that energy. Like, you one of a kind. Uh, Spirit, put one on this Six of Swords. the fooling yeah so um divine feminine the first message i got you could walk away from this situation with this um flighty energy person this person that's in and out and you know just take a leap of faith and just do something else or by you just Removing yourself from this situation and just let things play itself out. Um, you actually going to walk into a new beginning. Something new, some new endeavors or something's going to start for you anyways. So don't even trip about this person. It could be a fire sign, could be a earth sign. But it don't have to be. Spirit, put one on this ace of wands. He can't love you like I love you. Yeah, um, this person's a fucking knight. And Divine Feminine, you deserve an emperor or a fucking king. 
this person, I feel like this person that got you in your feelings or did something to you. Like I said, they, this person still is like a little boy. They could even look like a damn little boy and they a grown ass man. So, don't even trip. Spirit, who won on this Ace of, Ace of Wands? Ace of Swords. So, Divine Feminine, whatever you're thinking about, just know it's going to be, I just heard, abundance. You got some shit on your mind. It could be on how to make money or how to start something. And whatever you got on your mind, it's going to manifest because you're going to put in action. You're going to put in work. Um, Spirit, put one on this Three of Pentacles. What I tell y'all... What divine feminine, whatever you've been thinking about doing or pursuing or something, you're gonna you're gonna start pursuing it, something you're passionate about, and you're gonna be victorious out the situation. It's gonna be a victory for you. Okay, so let this whoever this knight of wands, this dude, this this grown ass man that look like a kid, let him just do him. Because at the end of the day, you a bad bitch. He don't have no... Divine Feminine, you need a grown-ass man that's on your level. This person is not on your level anyways. And then, whatever you about to work on, about to start doing, whatever you've been thinking about, it's going to manifest and you're going to be very victorious about the shit. Okay? Spirit, put one on this Seven of Pentacles and this Knight of Wands. Three of Wands. I feel like once you get in your bag or once you start pursuing whatever you want to do, I feel like this person on this night of Wands is going to see you like shining or they're going to see your glow up or something and they're going to want to like come back to fuck with you or come back to talk to you. They want to collaborate with you, do something. I heard business with you or something. I just heard back then you didn't want me. Now I'm how you want you all on me. However that resonate, but I feel like somebody wants to work with somebody, or they still want a person to be a part of their life in some way. Spirit, can you put one on the Empress and the Temperance card? Page of Cups. I feel like somebody's going to surprise you with a message or something. It's going to be unexpected. It could be this Knight of Wands. They ghosted you and you're going to forget all about them. And I feel like they're going to come back in to tell you something. I just heard Kid. You can find out somebody got a kid. That's a side message. Or it could be another message I just heard. Somebody could be looking up to you, Divine Feminine. It could be like a, a kid or a teenager. Or it could be like a girl in her early 20s. Somebody, I feel like somebody looks up to you. And they may communicate that with you. And if it's not that, it's, I feel like, um, it could be this night of ones that want to come in to tell you something, to talk to you, but it's going to be a surprise. And if it's not this night of ones, it could be like somebody from your past, a past friend, a past lover. I feel like somebody wants to talk to you, but it's going to, it's going to come out the blue. Spirit, can you put one on this six of swords and the fool card? It's going to be unexpected. 
Another message I'm getting, it could be a, a grown-ass woman that's childish as fuck, wants to talk to you. Divine Feminine. Can you put one on this Six of Swords and this Fool card? Five of Wands. I feel that Divine Feminine, once you let go of whatever don't serve you and you take a leap of faith to do something that you're passionate about, something that you've been thinking about doing, it's going to cause conflict with other people. I, I heard better than these people feel like these people that it's going to cause conflict with by you like doing you and you shining. It's going to cause conflict with these people because these people always thought they were better than you. Yeah, I feel like these people always thought they were better than you. And these people are not going to like that you actually walking in your purpose, taking a leap of faith, starting something new, not caring what people think or say about you. I feel like it's going to start some type of conflict and fights with people that always compare themselves to you or... Another message I'm getting, these people feel like you're better than them. Or they mad because they can't do what you're doing. I heard same effect. These people could be trying to do what you're doing, but it's just different when you do it. I don't know what this is, Divine Feminine, what you're trying to do. But I feel like people are watching you and they're going to be upset that you're, I just heard, on top. That you feeling good about yourself or something. Spirit, can you put one on this Ace of Swords and this Ace of Wands? The Emperor. <sighs> So, the emperor, I mean, the empress and the emperor, the divine masculine is here. Uh, what I got, the divine masculine could be thinking and going to put in action on coming forward towards you. Y'all have to watch my previous reading because the, the divine... Feminine and masculine popped up in my previous reading. Y'all go watch He Can't Love You Like I Love You. Um, I feel like the divine masculine wants to come forward. And they've been thinking about how to come forward. And they're going to actually put in motion or be active on how to come forward to you. I just heard be a better person. Um, this divine masculine could be thinking on um, what can they do to upgrade themselves. I just heard material wealth. Spirit, can you put one on the three of pentacles and the six of wands? Bitch, bitch, the motherfucking lovers. I feel, <laughs> dog, dog. So, again, I feel that like it's going to be hoes mad. It's going to be some people mad that the divine feminine and masculine going to come together. They're going to be in union. It's going to be a fucking victory. And I feel like it's going to be people mad about that. But yet, somebody, it could be the, the, the divine feminine or the divine masculine. Or it could be both of y'all. Both of y'all like, man, fuck that. We're going to take a leap of faith. We're going to see where this relationship go. Because 
she is destined, is divine. We're supposed to be together any fucking ways. We supposed to have haters. We supposed to <laughs> be the empress and the emperor. Okay? Like <laughs> dog, this is crazy. Um Y'all just be prepared, and I said this in my last reading, be prepared for a union or some type of y'all coming together of some shit. It's something about to happen. And then we in Mercury retrograde too. So during Mercury retrograde, X's come back during this time. So y'all just be prepared for that. Spirit, can you give me additional messages for this um, Divine Feminine reading? Y'all. The lovers, the emperor and the empress and the fucking lovers. A victory. The lovers came on top of the, the fucking six of wands. So this is going to be a victory. It came out like this. Okay? I can't make this up. My cards don't lie, bruh. Spirit, can you give me one um for this divine feminine reading? And I feel like it's gonna be some hating hoes. It's gonna be some hating ass hoes mad that you got a man and they don't. And a man that's gonna treat you right too. Okay? You divine feminine, you're not gonna have just no anybody. Like <laughs> this the emperor. The, the divine masculine could have some type of status or uh, some type of, he could be known or something. I feel like y'all going to be a power couple. I just heard influential. Oh, wow. Star bathing. It's a light body crystal grid transmission activation. I feel that um, y'all could be getting activated or like this enlightenment or something when you're sleeping. I feel like spirit could be working on you, divine feminine, when you sleep or this divine masculine. Or you have some type of vivid dreams, dream premonitions or some shit. Spirit, can you give me one, another one? This is my new deck. I actually got it for my birthday. It's the Star Seed Oracle deck. That one come out. Baby steps. Action. Follow your intuition before it makes sense. So I feel like um when y'all get into union, it's gonna be baby steps. Things unfolding over time. Yeah, y'all could be some type of power couple. It's possible. Double mission. Light worker. Star seed. Serve the world by being you. Um, I feel that Divine Feminine... You could actually be, you and Divine Masculine can be light workers. Y'all could be star seeds. And I feel that people look up to y'all. Or y'all have some type of influence on people's lives. Just because you just being you. It's a double mission. Light workers, star seed, serve the world by being you. I feel like people are admired by you or... They look up to you. I just heard secretly. You could have like secret admirers or people. I just heard wish to be you. Oh, wow. Yes, Divine Feminine. Spirit, give me another one. It's that a new earth. It's happening. Keep holding the vision. So, whatever you've been planning and want to do, it's a, a new earth. It's happening. Keep holding the vision. 
So divine feminine, don't get discouraged or anything. Because something, I feel like something great, something good is about to happen to you. You just have to be patient. Period. But that's all I have for this reading, Divine Feminine. Thank you. Bye-bye.